Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today's video is going to be a Chanel unboxing. I'm so excited. Okay, so let me explain because I do feel like when I make purchases like this, I do feel the need to kind of explain myself. I know I don't have to, but I would like to. So I was, uh, about a week ago, I was off for the entire week and it was great. I took my daughter to school every day. I picked her up and I actually did a vlog, so I'll be sure to link that at the end of the video. But anyway, I was on the hunt. I wanted to buy something special. So I went to Neiman Marcus. I went to a couple of the little boutiques and I really didn't see anything. But then when I went back the second day, I saw a little something. So I decided to treat myself. It's nothing big. It's just a little tiny thing that I wanted to show you guys. But I ended up selling one of my Louis Vuitton bags on Fashion File. And so the money that I got from that purchase, I put it towards this. And so I wanted to share with you guys. And I also did a video on Fashion File, so I'll be sure to link that at the end as well in case you're interested in checking it out. I kind of show you, I tell you all about my experience and I kind of take you step by step on how to do it. It was a really, really easy process. I went to Neiman Marcus and I went to the Chanel there and I saw a little item that I thought would be perfect. Like I said, I wasn't on the hunt for a handbag because that's really, really pricey. I just wanted something little that I could put in some of my smaller crossbody bags. An example of that would be this. This is a little Louis Vuitton crossbody bag that I have and I love, but I found that the wallet that I have is way too big and if I put it in this handbag I can't fit anything else so I just wanted to get something small so let me show you what I picked up so I went ahead and I picked up it is the Chanel timeless classic mini flap card holder now I had something specific that I was looking for and guys I couldn't find it anywhere I put it in the vlog I was looking for a little wallet on a chain I want that classic Chanel flap I want lance lambskin I wanted uh, silver and I just could not find it I think the bags I like are more of the vintage bags so I might have to end up going to fashion vile to get what I really really want but I did find something that was kind of close to it. So first every Chanel bag or wallet or anything it comes packaged nicely in this little box like this. So and I always hold on to my receipts in case I want to resell it and it comes with this little Chanel kind of tells you a little bit about it. And then it, this came nicely wrapped in a little Chanel. This is like a velvet holder. This is how I'm going to store it. So let me show you what I got. Okay, so I thought this was so cute. So again, this is a little Chanel card holder. Now it is patent leather. I wasn't able to find the lambskin, and I'm not a huge, huge fan of the caviar, but I thought this would just be absolutely perfect to kind of fit it in my crossbody bags. I could put a little bit of cash. I could put my credit card. I could put my license, and it would just be a nice on-the-go pouch, or if I'm going to the gym, or if I just need to bring a quick little wallet with me, and I don't want to lug around my large one. This one has a little silver Chanel hardware it's not very big um, just you know here's the palm of my hand you can see it's about the palm of my hand it's not big at all but you open it up and it has a little button and every Chanel bag is gonna come with the it comes with this Chanel number which I hold on to all of this stuff in the box in case I want to sell it again and then it comes with the authenticity card which is huge so let me take all of this stuff out so you can see what's in it so you can see on the inside it has the Chanel logo right here and it says made in Italy it has one little card holder here and then on the inside it's just like a pouch it's just you know you can put a little bit of change in there I think what I'm probably going to do is put my license on a card here, maybe a little bit of cash, and then you just, it's really, really tiny, but like I said, in this bag, if it's perfectly close it up, I can put my phone, a couple other things, and it's just a really good wallet to have for smaller handbags. So again, I just, I love the Chanel brand. It's just always very classic, and I feel like if you purchase their pieces, it's a good investment, but it's something that you can always use. I do have a Chanel flat bag and I absolutely love it and I had been really wanting to buy another piece without investing a lot of money so I did find this what I thought was really really cute and I wanted to share it with you guys so again it's not very large at all this is patent leather but again it's just a nice little card holder perfect for on the go so that's what I picked up and I am a firm believer that you guys have to treat yourself and now what I like to do is I feel like if I sell a bag I can take that money and I can put it towards buying a bag or buying a wallet and I think I'm gonna get a lot of use out 
out of this for sure. They have come out with a lot of really nice Chanel items lately, but I just like the basic black because for me, that's what I'm going to use all the time. They had a lot of beautiful colors, but I don't know, black, it's just kind of something I always gravitate for. And also, you can just kind of use this as like a little tiny clutch carrying it with you too, and it just looks so classic and timeless. So... It's a quick video. I just wanted to show you guys what I picked up. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any questions about, you know, how this works out, you know, the size, anything like that, make sure to let me know. Again, I got it from I got it from Chanel and Neiman Marcus, and it is called the Timeless Classic Mini Flap Card Holder, and it's in black patent leather, and so I'm really excited about it. So I hope you guys have a good day. Make sure to hit that little subscribe button if you haven't already, and make sure to follow me on Instagram as well. That's at AmberAshley35. I would love to have you join me over there. And again, thanks again for taking the time out of your day, and I will see you next time.